Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the final of this regional qualifying event of this weekend's Nile Special National Open Pool Championship. We are at Black Sports Bar and Restaurant in the northern city of Gulu, 350 kilometers north of Kampala. The players in the final are both winners. They are both finalists already. They have already qualified for the big showpiece, the grand finale coming up on the 11th of November this year. It is Caesar Chandiga taking on Samson Odong, resting to five. My name is Peter Chobe on behalf of the Pool Association of Uganda coming back shortly. That is an apple. In the semi-finals, Caesar used 15 minutes to qualify to beat the semi-final opponent. Thank you for watching Jose Isaac Apeño Calvin from the United Arab Emirates Phil David Yes, you're uploading Caesar Golden Color like Ways. You say Caesar is your favorite. Herbert Spencer Mutabuki says Caesar could take Jeremiah as well, and you are supporting from Zimbabwe. One zero courtesy of an apple from Caesar in the very first frame of the match. Samson Odong is a very well respected player here in Gulu. He always moves to Kampala to participate in the big tournaments, especially the ones organized by the Polar Association of Uganda. Meanwhile, Aaron Opio has defeated Ojok to qualify as number three. 1-0. Caesar in the lead. If I'm not mistaken, he has lost one frame, one game in this tournament. One. One 
Daniel Robert wa Maluku says Caesar make sure John Sparks Abu Bakar Nasir Abdi you say Caesar all the way from Nigeria thank you for watching Nigeria full fraternity Golden Kalali watching from Zambia in Serenje thank you for watching Shamira Spina hi to you gift Sambiri You are saying Caesar as usual and you are supporting from Malawi. How about Spencer Motubuki? You are says you say Caesar all the way from Zimbabwe. Gilbert Rumbere, you say bye Caesar. I don't know what you mean, you support him or not. Sean Scomping is a it is the final, the last match of the tournament, which has been a good a tournament dominated mostly by Caesar because he has made the light work of his qualification exercise really. Luckily, all of his games have been streamed live. You can go back. He only faced some difficulty, I think, in one match. If I'm not mistaken, he lost only one frame in the second round. The rest of the rounds were 1 4 0. This is Samson Odong trying to inflict. Another game, another defeat on Caesar. He loses the white ball, he's snookered. You wonder where he's getting the pressure, he has already qualified. He simply needs to concentrate, be calm, and play his game. Thank you for watching our noob Dennis Chidugwajo from Abu Dhabi. Coach Kenrick from Kenya, thank you for watching. Wamui Makelvin from Zambia, Kanyama. One zero in a race to five. At times players come out of that angle with a lot of strength hoping that they could put in the process. Good connection shot. He's going for the corner pocket in the background of your screen. And he puts, how is the white ball? It is safe, it looks safe. He needs one or two big shots. Clearing this frame will not come very easy. Will he put the white? No, he won't. What can he do? This shot must be big. He simply pots, hoping to use more or less the same skill to put the corresponding yellow ball in the other corner pocket. Concentration, shot on target, definitely game down. Caesar 2, Samson Odong 0, rest to 5. Just look at the vibe in the place. Low music in the background. These are happy faces, ladies and gentlemen. Happy faces there. Especially when Caesar is performing. He breaks and puts reds. The table is open, the balls are well split. In my opinion, he can go with any color as long as he can report. He has a starting ball to put with, goes for yellows, closes the table, he is playing yellows. Omosa is saying, I take the camera to the left, where I'm standing is the 
Only favorable place where I can place the camera. The place is kind of crowded. Caesar is still yearning for more. It seems as though this could be his year, this young man. He's the most informed player in the country without a shadow of a doubt. He has so far lost one big one, a final. He's so dominant on the front of many matches and midweek competitions. But for the tournaments organized by the Polar Association of Uganda, the tournaments which matter the most, he has so far, so far, not performed very well. Is this the time? Today has looked as though it is. And he puts, even when the margins are too thin, he finds a way out. Looking to put to play the yellow off the angle. He puts again, ladies and gentlemen. This guy can sometimes be crazy. And yet he is snookered once again. As if the fans want him to remain snookered so that they keep entertained. He will play black off the cushion, off the bottom cushion with a little spin on the white ball as it seems to be. He misses this time. Advantage, Samson. Thank you for watching. Ntai Ryan. Wanyera Robert wa Maluku. Our master name is Nick. You're supporting Caesar. Chuka Wakiai watching from Chuka Meru. I think that is Kenya. Mwesuga George from Hoima, the oil city. Welcome to the stream. We are closing in once again on the 1000 mark. Very good publicity stunt is this spot receiving nowadays. Caesar misses again foul advantage. Samson Odong. Odong with two shots. A very open game it is for him. He's a decent shooter in himself. Though at times you play with Caesar and you find yourself dwarfed. He's a decent shooter. You can see how much he is fighting for this frame. If we can make it 2-1, then the game is on again. One ball to go, he needs to pot. That's a given almost, but he needs a good white on the black. Goes for a fancy shot, uses a little more energy than he would have wanted, but still, maybe, maybe, maybe. Odong pots. He too has fans of his own. There are the cheers. It is not a Caesar place only. Odong has his own fun, ladies and gentlemen. Caesar leads now 2 1. We are at Cuba in Gulu. This all started at noon. And in the next few minutes, we shall have known who the champion will be. The second runner up. And the third runner up, those are the three important people who qualify for the grand finale. In position number three, it's confirmed for Aaron Opio, the guy who lost to Caesar in the semis, has defeated his opponent in the third place match. Aaron qualifies for the national open, but with no prizes as of today. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
Two one, ladies and gentlemen. Odong Samson down. His nickname the Rasta. I think because of his uh, hairstyle. Caesar has quite some names, but the most famous one is the Scorpion. And there was another name which came up once, one time earlier this year, when he was referred to as the dictator. That one he rejected. Luis Majamanda from Mali. Thank you and welcome to the stream. Caesar on the yellows. Definitely with one thing on his mind, only to sweep away the yellows and the black and make it 3 0 in his current visit of the table. Good shooting. He has a number of options. Starts with the yellow in the corner pocket on the left of your screen. No problem, he uses the red as the support to get white for the next year, next ball. He uses the cue ball so well, Caesar. Will he start with the center pocket ball? As if it is the best, but it doesn't guarantee a white ball for the next ball if he doesn't miss. When you are about supporting Caesar, Richard Clayberson, you seem to be supporting Caesar. I used to know you as a fan of Amos. Thank you for my goodies, Kleber. Gagamel Chairman. Lubanga Kenny Joel. Thank you for watching. Wandile Bekiswayo. Ntai Rayane. As if you're waiting for the scorpion dust. What can he do? Misses. Opportunity for Odong. He has one tricky ball, that red which is near the yellow in the center pocket. After this game, this is the final game, by the way. If you have not watched, you are not going to watch it until you go to YouTube and follow up. After this game, after winning, this is the final. And he snookers himself, Samson. The opportunity to equalize Sim seems to have gotten blown away in thin air. Unless he can produce some magic here. Find his red and he finds the red. But I don't know if that is enough, especially against Caesar. Everything about the clearance is accurate. Caesar on the black for three one. Yes, he does. Caesar three. Samson Odong one. Rest to five for the bragging rights and the money. The main intention to qualify for the grand final has already been achieved by both players. It's about in which position you qualify. Of course, the position has got financial attributes to it. Yeah, it is. 
Sisa is two games away from being Gulu champion of the Nile Special National Open Pool Championship this year. He breaks and puts reds and yellows. Table is open, balls are scattered, it looks scary. If you are dong. Thank you for watching. Sarah Desadami, you are saying Caesar the Incredible. Chendai Chigumbu, you are from Zimbabwe, he says another apple from Caesar is loading. And I wouldn't contest with you so much. Not given the way he's clearing the table and opening up what were the bad balls. He can go with either of those balls. But misses. Everyone, ladies and gentlemen, this is up. This is the most important pool tournament to these players. It is very prestigious to win. It's even prestigious only and only to qualify. For each player who qualifies for the grand finale, there are about 40 victims. It means every qualifier, it can only be one out of each 40. That's why it is prestigious even to qualify in the first place. Look at Caesar. He's very serious, makes it 4-1, ladies and gentlemen. Caesar is one match away from victory, one frame away, one win, one game away from victory while the opening Samson Odong needs to win all four. Yeah, you know, it is, it, it is not as simple as that people have not married. Masafu is asking why Kenneth Odong is not playing. Oh, I think the top eight seeded players do not need to go through the qualification process according to the rules of the tournament by the Polar Association of Uganda. The top eight of the year do not need to play qualifiers. They go to the grand finale direct. For this year, the top eight are seed number eight, Yuda Sembo, seed number seven, seed number seven, Joseph Kasozi, seed number six, Habib Sebuguzi, seed number five, Buani Kamansuru, seed number four, Sejemba Ibra, seed number three, Senyonjo Gloria, seed number two, Kenneth Odong, and seed number one, Kayanja Ibra. Those do not play qualifiers. They are the top seeds of their qualification. All ranking is gotten through the summation of number of points each player obtains in a year from tournaments organized by the Pool Association of Uganda only. Not money matches, not battles, 
not midweek tournaments, only pool association of Uganda calendar tournaments like this one. It has the highest amount of points among tournaments because it's the one which is national in nature. The Kampala Open, also the Grand Open, King of the Table, Pool Queen, then team events like the Pool League and the Clubs Knockout as well as events involving the national team as well as it is sanctioned by the pool association of uganda it is the event which measures ranking points thank you for one scissor playing for one thing only and that is victory I think he intends to put the red ball near the center pocket to the corner pocket nearest to your screen. Accurate, accurate. Does he have space? Yes, he has. This should be it for Samson. This should be it for the match. This should be for the tournament. This should be it with Caesar. Yes, congratulations, Caesar. You qualify for the Nile Special National Open Grand Finale. For is it the third time? Yeah, it's the third time. How do you feel? I feel very excited because uh, it was uh, really challenging for me. I was fearing that uh, the qualifiers most. You normally play most of your tournaments in Kampala nearby, but you came to Gulu twice to qualify for the minis and the regionals. What was your motivation? Uh, I was so motivated by the fans around me. My, most of them were my friends, uh, the best I've been seeing years back. So I'm really excited uh, actually to come back and play with them again. You have so many fans from around this place and beyond. What can they expect from you in the grand final? You have so many fans from here and beyond. What can they expect from you? Uh, all I can promise them is that I will continue doing my best and what the, I'll, uh, if we go to Lugoko, I'll make sure I keep up the spirit. And I'll do my best. Congratulations once again and I wish you good luck.